nothing has really been happening yet. Uh, making like colloidal shungite water, you know. Trying to see what's up with these fullerenes and you know, all these buckyballs, whatever they call them. So I've, I've been adding more and more elite shungite to the bottom of the water. It's because uh, shungite is highly uh, conduct conductive. So got my three nine volt batteries, uh, alligator clips with two elite shungite pieces, you know. And um, just add more and more uh, elite sugar to the to the glass to the jar of distilled water, you know, until uh, it barely touches the uh, alligator clips. Yeah. So that's what's going on. So regardless if anything uh, happens, uh, they say if you keep elite shungite in water that's how it absorb absorbs the uh fullerenes or aka buckyballs uh basically spherical hollow carbon there's not too much scientific stuff that i've seen on shungite it's just like old stories of shungite growth uh is two billion years old you know the basic stuff two billion years old it's in Russia somewhere, Shunga, Russia, or whatever. Uh, it purifies water. That's what the Russians say. Who knows if Russian water is the same type of quality and meets the same standards as water over here in the U.S. So who knows? But uh, the only way to find out is to try. That's it. Peace, perfect balance, past, present, and future.